Hello YouTube and welcome to part 2 of this scenario creation uh, video whereby we're creating uh, consist on the North London line going to Stratford. In part 1 we set up our consist over here uh, beginning with the class 70 pulling some containers and we set, set up the directions for it to go over to Stratford over there somewhere far far away. In part 2 we'll be setting up some of the uh, first AI and uh, having a look at how that's going to interact with the train that we're using. I haven't yet decided if we're going to be waiting for one or two AI, if we're going to need to wait uh, for it to clear. I think the best thing to do is to move, have, have them both in the station and have them both pull off. So we're only waiting for this one to come around to give us something to look at, whilst we wait for this one to clear the block and for us to get the green signal. Then what will happen is we will come into uh, Cali Road and we'll be waiting for one that will be behind us starting from Kentish Town and uh, so I think that's a, a good place to start with and a good thing to try looking at setting up today. This is what I call interfering uh, AI because it interferes with our train causing us to stop or us causing them to stop. On the other side of the coin you have non-interfering, we'll be looking at that a bit later. That's just stuff that runs normally doing what it does without getting in the way. Now you'll notice that I gave the video a title, this is now called Felix Stowe Freightliner. Because of where we come out at Stratford it makes sense that the train would have gone on to Felix Stowe. And so that will go into the instructions when we write them. Um, and it just means that then we have a nice... Um, a nice run through, a purpose to, to the scenario, and it's already been named, so, uh, right, carrying on, we need the overground five car uh, unit, let's bring up the consist here, capital star, third rail, five car, five car overhead, we want that overhead section, we want it near the front of the platform, but with enough room because they like to move when they start. Okay, so there's that one. And this is obviously going to be the front of the train. So we'll put a driver on it. No, we won't. We'll put a driver on it. There we go. And then if we just move down the other side, we can put another one on. Again, we'll make this a five car train and we'll have that just coming into Camden Road. And again, we'll put a driver on it. Uh, it's this one for a driver. Lovely. So that now sets up a train that's in our way. So this train it will be stopping at all stations. That will then uh, give us something to follow, it'll mean that we'll be stopping at a few red zone routes, uh, it'll mean that we, uh, we'll be needing to wait a little bit as we go round, and then that in itself will affect our arrival time into Stratford, um, just trying to get it down a little bit, make it a little bit more, more realistic, but then this train gives us something to look at as it goes round to Kentish Town, and disappears off in a portal far far away over there. So we'll make it stop at Kentish Town and then the next portal that we can find which will probably be Gospel Oak no uh, beyond Gospel Oak then anyway around here somewhere there's bound to be another portal that we can just run that straight into. Okay so let's get back to where we are in Camden that's not where we are in Camden. On the bridge. Lovely. So let's uh, let's give these two trains a name, shall we? One will be called Service One, the other one Service Two. Okay, you'll see that now all of a sudden all of this has gone red and it's saying I can't do this. I can't get past that train, but that's fine. Because we're going to say yes you can. Alright, so service one, the first thing that you're going to do is, we delete that, we're not going to do that, we're going to pick up passengers, and then we're going to pick up passengers again, and then we're going to go into a portal. So 
where are we going to start picking up passengers? Well, obviously, the first place he's going to pick up passengers is the platform he's at. So, this now gets a lot harder now that we have everything on the lights. So we're going to pick up passengers at Camden Road Platform 1. liking that so I might actually have to pick this one from the drop down menu can't seem to get it in there any closer no nope, we'll pick this one from the drop down so Camden Road platform one okay so that's his first marker he's then gonna out of there and come up to Kentish Town, which is up here, and at Kentish Town West, he's going to pick up passengers again. Now technically he could actually stay here because we're probably not going to see him uh, after this moment because we're going to continue on nicely and do our thing. But just for neatness, for help with the game we'll route him round and there is no more portal as far as I can see for him to go into so it might just be then that we move him up to Gospel Oak and we have done with him there I just I don't like leaving them lying around Move him up to Gospel Oak. I don't care whether or not he picks anybody up because we're not watching him at this point and he's gone. Lovely. So that's this train. You see now he has his uh, ready to go. Now for the train that's in our way. Now he's going to go all the way into Stratford not going to go all the way straight into Stratford. He's got to do all the stops that we did before. Right, we're also going to rename service one. We're going to make him a I one. Lovely. That tells me that I've finished with that train. That train is now finished with and I don't need to think about it anymore. Now we will have to here and select service 2. Service 2 begins by stopping at Camden Road to pick up passengers. So we click on there, we try and pick this up again. There we go. Okay, so he's now picking up passengers from there. He's then going to come down and pick up passengers from the Cali. Okay, and actually you'll now find that it says yes, I'm happy with that, because he's out of my way. So just once that's there, we need to rename him. No, we don't, we do that last. But we're going to make him a stopping passenger train. The other one that we need to make a stopping passenger is AI1. Just whilst it's in my mind. So he is now also a stopping passenger. Lovely. So what have we got so far? We've got one train that passes us, one train that we follow into Camden and to Cali Road, but then he stops, which is not good. So we need him to carry on picking up passengers as he goes at Highbury and Islington platform 8 no it's not a stop at destination it's a pick up pick up passengers at platform 8 pick up passengers at Canterbury all the stops that we put in for us as go-fires 
this train is going to stop at. Okay, that then means that actually I'm not following this train, hopefully. If it's quick enough, I'm following the train behind it, which will pass me at Cali Road. So I will have two stopping services ahead of me that will be affecting each other, as well as myself. Okay, we're picking up again here. Dalston, Hackney Central. Coming along the line to Homerton. Lovely. And you'll see that this keeps coming up, we're just ignoring that for now. That's still shouting at me because my train can't pass. And then you, no, we're not going via, we're going to. We're going to pick up passengers at Hackney Wick. And then he is going to come across here and into one of the Stratford uh, sidings for the overground trains. We'll make it platform two. So he's going to pick up passengers at platform two. Like so. Okay, now you'll see all of a sudden now the dispatcher says, yes, I can do that. I can run this train all the way through to Stratford and get it out of the way in platform 2 to allow me in my service to come through and you'll find that now look we're getting in at 15.56 now what happens at Cali? we leave Cali at 15.36 service 2 leaves at 15.33 so we're 3 minutes behind this, that's not a problem Okay, we have about a three minute wait into Camden Road. I'm more than happy with that as a, as a wait uh, before we start. So we'll be, we will be following this service into Camden Road. And then we'll have a second service overtake us at Cali. And then we'll have a nice run into Stratford. Okay, lovely. So uh, that's them to uh, interfering AI set up. So now we have the slightly more difficult job of doing the one that's behind us. When we've done that we're going to go to the other end and we will have to set up the ones that will already be in Hackney in Stratford Station waiting to depart when we get there. Okay, because this is a full rail operation we do want it to try and seem real even though it isn't. So let us now come up to Kentish Town and we shall put in a, uh, a train up there and we shall set that up to come past us and then that will be it for today's video. We'll have done all the interfering AI. So here's Kentish Town. Uh, we can't quite see it so it makes it a nice place for us to put a, a train. If we really wanted to we could bring it back to Gospel Oak and we could make it run down here. But I want it to be almost hot on our tails as we come through. So we need to put down a class 5 car overhead. Like that. Right, you are going to start by picking up here because that will give me the 30 seconds that I may need to move around. So we've given him a driver. And we're now going to set up the timetable view. We have AI1. And service 1. What happened to service 2? It's gone. No, all of that has gone. Okay, so we're going to press undo 
undo, undo until it appears back. There we go. Okay, never fear when that happens. And in fact, we're going to just quickly save the changes. That way, if it does happen again and we get too far along, we can just reload it back in. Right, so let's put back in this train here. And let's give him a driver again. Lovely. Right, so now we're going to rename service 1, rename service 2, AI2. Again, telling me that I'm done with that, I'm happy, so on and so forth. Now we have the new service 1. This one will be a stopping passenger. Okay, so let's move up to it, there we go, and the first thing that he's going to do is pick up passengers here, at Kentish Town. Now he's ready to leave at 30.41, that is going to put him ahead of us, so we're going to change this and make this three minutes later. So he's going to be stopped there for 30 minutes, yes, but he's now going to leave at 33.41, which moves him behind us. Maybe a little bit too far behind us, so let's, instead of that, let's knock the 30 seconds off. Where oh, are we? Service 1. So he's just sat there for 3 minutes. 33.06. Okay, so that should keep him behind us. Now it's very a good idea at this point to actually check the time that we get into Camden. So what time do I get into Camden as the player train? Just whilst I'm here, let's tell it that I'm the player train. We get in at 15.32.52. So if that changes, then we know that this train here is leaving too early. So we're going to tell him to pick up at Camden Road 1, uh, Camden Road 2 even. So I want you to pick up there. There we go. Right, that's now 15.35.16. 15.32.52, lovely. Right, I'm now going to just bring this down slightly to see if we can make it that little bit closer without changing my time. Okay, now all of a sudden it said no, we can't do that because I can't get into Cali because once again he's in the way. So we need to change that time back again. We'll make that up to 50. Okay, still arriving at 32.56. I'm 32.52, 32.56, lovely. So as soon as I've passed this one, he'll be allowed in through that one. So he really will be hot on our tails. Okay. Yep, so he's then allowed in at that time, 35.50, that's still quite a, quite a way behind us. Again, we'll just see if we can knock another 10 seconds off it. Thirty-four fifty-six. that stopped us from getting in. What about if we made that 45? Lovely. That's the closest that I can get. Right, so how, how far behind us is that? That's about three minutes behind us, isn't it? Yes, yeah, so we'll check the time at which he gets into Cali Road, which we're going to tell him to do now. So we come back to here, service one. And you're going to pick up passengers from Caledonian Road. When you can sense them 
marker. There we go. So you're now coming into Caledonian mode and Barnsbury at 38.28, leaving at 39.03. So what about us? Where does that leave us? We're getting in at 36. If we're leaving at 39, that means we've waited for another three minutes. Okay, we're going to see how that works. So let's wait here for three minutes. Okay, that doesn't matter at the moment because that's for Highbury and Islington. So we'll continue with this in part three of our video. Thank you very much for those of you who've watched. Let me just come out of this so then we can see our trains again. Thank you very much to everyone who's watched me uh, set up these trains. Uh, if you've liked the video, please hit the like button, uh, comment or subscribe. And tune in again for part three of our Felix Stowe Freight scenario creation. Thank you very much for watching guys.